Hello everybody, this is Ken from ilikemyiphone.com and I'm going to quickly demonstrate the software unlock that was released by dev team for the iPhone uh, 3G recently. So this is uh, Apple iPhone 16 gig uh, which is locked to Rogers network in Canada. So I'm going to use a T-Mobile SIM and uh, uh, it's, since it's locked to uh, Rogers Obviously, we won't be getting a signal with T-Mobile. So, before you even proceed any further, uh, make sure you quick pawn your device, like jailbreak your device using quick pawn software, um, either on Windows or Mac. Um, you have to be on the latest firmware that's 2.2, uh, which has a 2.28 baseband, and the software unlock works only on 2.28 baseband, and some. So please take a look at uh, the quick pawn video which I uh, uh, which I published on YouTube and some other video sites. So once you uh, once you jailbreak your device, um, that you should be having a Cydia and installer applications on your home screen. That's Cydia right there and installer. Uh, you can use either uh, of the application to uh, for the software unlock. But we are going to use Cydia because it has consistently performed uh, very good on for the 2.0 frameworks onwards. So let's launch uh, Cydia. Make sure you're connected to the Wi-Fi network because we are going to download an application. Uh, that's Yellow Snow. Uh, that's the code name for um, iPhone unlock, iPhone 3G unlock. iPhone 2G users, please. Uh, uh, don't even try attempting this. Uh, I have some users on my blog group trying uh, firmwares from for 3G iPhone, 2G iPhone. 2G iPhones are all j um, unlockable. Like uh, it's it's much more sophisticated unlock that was released long back for iPhone 2G. This, this is exclusive for iPhone 3G. So uh, let's uh, make sure we are connected to Wi-Fi and let's launch Cydia. So as soon as you launch Cydia for the first time, uh, you will be prompted uh, to upgrade um, some essential frameworks that are, uh, that are required for Cydia to perform uh, well, like mobile substrate and some other uh, program related uh, uh, software. Please upgrade everything to the latest version, like they, uh, they show it like essential upgrades. Hit the hit the essential upgrades and make sure you are you have everything installed and then uh, also make sure you don't have any more prompts. Once you're done uh, upgrading everything on Cydia, uh, click on Manage. We are going to actually add the source uh, for iPhone 3G unlock. Click on Sources. Click on the Edit button on the top right corner. Please excuse the um, poor quality of the video. I just want to give a quick outlook of what the whole uh, unlocking process is like uh, for the newbies because uh, I don't really have a video dedicated video equipment. So click on the add button on the top right, top left corner, and you should see something like this Enter Cydia APT URL. So Hit, uh, type in apple paul nine dot yellowsnow dot com. So it's apt nine dot y e l l o w s n zero. It's not o. It's um, zero s n zero w dot com. So it's apt9.yellowsnow.com and hit the add source button it should update your source I'm sure in some countries there's uh, um, the internet is not so fast for Wi-Fi so what you can do is create an ad hoc network on your PC or a Mac and uh, use it as a wireless access point and connect it 
to Wi-Fi. If you have any issues creating an ad hoc network, you can always post the comments on my blog, I like my So, so once you see the complete screen, click on Return to Cydia. So there you go. That's that's the source we just added, which contains the software unlock. Click on Done. Okay. So click on apt9.yellowsnow.com that's just added, and you should see yellow snow that's the software unlock click on yellow snow and click on install so that's a six kilobyte application I tried all the versions uh, of yellow snow that were released since uh, January 1st and right now um, it's um, 0.9.5 beta so that's the best version uh, available right now because uh, T-Mobile had issues uh, making call outgoing calls and some of the networks too uh, that issue seems to be resolved uh, with 0.9.5 so click on confirm and you should see yellow snow being installed on your phone so wait, wait till you see a prompt. Uh, don't do anything. Don't press the home button. Nothing, because uh, okay. Wait till you see return to Cydia button. Click on return to Cydia. And you can change the package settings. Uh, make sure it's on. Show all changes to on, because. Um, such so, that so we can uh, upgrade to the latest version of the unlock and the software unlock is actually um, a code injected after every time you boot so what we have to do now is uh, reboot your iPhone I am using uh, SB settings uh, this is a very popular application which is um, which should be actually uh, which should have been incorporated into the iPhone, iPhone firmware by Apple but what you can do is, on this software is that you can enable disable 3G, Bluetooth you can change the brightness, you can enable disable Wi-Fi, you can see what all processes are, processes are running on your iPhone and, and the like so, and, I, and also you can click on power and you can reboot your iPhone real quick you don't have to hold the home button, uh, hold the power button and all Okay, so I hit the reboot button, so it should automatically reboot. So, this is a wonderful achievement by the dev team. They have been working very hard uh, uh, for quite some time now. And uh, with the latest version 0 0.9.5, um, so most of the issues related to SIM STK or uh, pin unlock being resolved. So that's the home screen that's, that you see as soon as you reboot your phone. Right now it's uh, trying to, the code is being injected to your iPhone and you should see the signal right away. So, so you see T Mobile signal right there. And let's quickly demonstrate the call outgoing calls. Okay, I dial six one one. T Mobile for English, say English. Para continuar en español, diga español. So there you go. So T-Mobile outgoing calls have no problems. Um, this is the latest SIM that is uh, 39. Or say your mobile number. Area uh, that starts with 39. Uh, so these are the batch. Uh, this belongs to the batch of SIM cards which which were having issues uh, with with the unlock. Uh, but right now it's it seems to be working just fine for outgoing calls as well. So that's that's. Uh, good news for T-Mobile users in the US and some other networks uh, worldwide. So there you go, so the iPhone 3G software unlocked um, to perfection by the dev team, so all thanks to the dev team and uh, uh, Sorik from Cydia, he did a, ter a remarkable job with Cydia.